much money. Apparently I pitched the tent in a midge nest. So I have to pack up quickly and move on. Bordier is panicking. What can I do? I'll try to move slowly. No, 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 no. Don't hurt yourself. I'll just go to this way. No. No, don't do this. Don't do this! No, don't do this! What a beautiful morning! And this deer Oh god, I feel so bad. I hope it's not hurt. The second day started fantastic. It's really nice area. It's a huge improvement if we compare day one. The plan for today is uh, walking along the Loch Lagan, so I expect that it will be nice as well. I don't have exact mileage in heart uh, to do today, but uh, well, if I'll be able to. Uh, to reach the end of the lock, it will be will be great. one it should lead me to the forest or what I can see ahead of me remains of the forest and that's uh, another about five kilometers and that will be end of section two Stop for breakfast in the valley behind me, but oh gosh, it, it's truly mid Dorado. <laughs> no, it's I was running around trying to uh, keep in move uh, just to reduce the amount of bites I got. So on the map it's marked as a forest and it was some time ago. So I climbing and there's no wind at all today. Not even the lightest breeze, nothing. The, the air just stays in place. 
Uh, that's another aspect that is very image friendly. I hope the weather will change slightly. I hope for a little more sun that and this will this will move the area around. This is nice viewpoint. I don't mind such scenery. I don't mind it at all. Beautiful day for hike. That's marker number four. It seems that the second stage is much better way marked than in the previous one. Because on the first stage there was none of the markers and on second stage within three hours I I saw four of them. I didn't realize but here in the clouds is the hill I climbed earlier this year. It's ten o'clock and we uh, descending from the forest to the to this uh, little settlement and our trail joining the road so road walking for some time as you can imagine this highland way is much quieter than west highland way and there's not many and there's not many people here Yesterday I met on the trail only one uh, young lady, uh, passed her and uh, today, today I, I noticed a group of uh, five uh, hikers from some of the Scandinavian countries, can't tell. And that's it for for now, I wonder how it will look like closer to Aviumor. And I'll keep you updated. Again, change of the scenery. I'm just entering the forest, so and it will last for well, at least ten miles. Uh, so <clears throat> I just passed the group of Scandinavians I saw in the morning. Um, they have huge backpacks. Really huge, enormous. I don't know, 80 liters or something. So they'll have to rest quite often, I believe. If they are, if they are doing East Highland Way, I don't think I'll see them again. You can see what's beneath the grass. Oh, nice potholes. And the walk through the forest continues. It's a nice track. Not too hard, not too brutal for the feet.
and Bob Dylan singing to my ear. I just left the forest and going to Loch Lagan. On the way I had a one hour break. I made a uh, hot lunch and uh, uh, basically relaxed. I, I did it first time in my life and I cannot believe how refreshing it is. I'll have to do it more often. This is the road to so this is the track to the Loch Bagan and in front of me four Scandinavians so we we pass each other uh, on the way today I'm surprised how well they are doing with such huge backpacks They passed me when <coughs> they passed me by when I had this one hour break. Now I am again catching up and just judging by the speed I think I'll I'll again pass them by. And here it is. No flag on. Golden beaches of Loch Lagan. So, six kilometers left, and I'll be looking for a camp for today. So, I estimate that it will take um, an hour and a half, something like that. Uh, by the way, I had a chat with People like all Scandinavians, now I know that they are Swedish. Nice guys, they walk East Highland Way and of course they are aiming uh, Aviamore. So, so it's quite possible that I will meet them again soon. This looks like a good camping ground, but too early for me. I got an hour or so hiking. The log, the trail, and the trees. Impressive. Unexpected garden. So I'm back in the forest and I hope I hope this truck will will go again slightly to the lake and then I'll find something and um, some place to camp. It's about time. The walking was so nice and it's so early but I just noticed that I'm done with Loch Lagan and I won't be camping there. Huh. It's a bit of disappointment because I wanted to come by the lake. But well, my road and my target. This is where I'm going so soon. Right, I'm finishing my day. 
I, <coughs> I've done 42k, much more than expected and much more than planned. Um, but well, it happened, so I'm officially midway. So finishing in two days um, seems possible. Uh, Well, on my way to the to the beach, and uh, I won't be filming there. I'm too tired. I just want to uh, wash, eat, and go to sleep. So, speak to you tomorrow.